What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another episode of Looking for Legends, a series where we open 3,000 FIFA points worth of packs every episode hoping to bag ourselves a legend. Um, I actually want to talk about packs and pack opening openings for this episode. Uh, as per usual guys, I'll show you the first two packs, the best packs and the last two packs. Before we actually get into the video, if you would like to purchase any FIFA Ultimate Team coins of your own, check out footcoinemporium.com. Their link is in the description below. A very fast and reliable service and if you use the discount code NEPO at checkout, you will get 5% off of your coins. So in the very first pack there, we get David De Gea. Um, now I want to talk about pack openings and this series compared to the Packed Out series, which is where I guarantee and inform um, in every pack opening series. And um, I want to just explain as to why I'm doing Looking for Legends rather than Packed Out. And the simple solution is this, right? Since Legends have been introduced to the market, my pack luck has dropped massively. I'm talking massively. I've opened, since Legends, which is now, by the time you're watching this video, eight uh, six days legends have been out since you've been what like uh, upon you guys watching this video and in that six days I've spent around a hundred and eighty thousand FIFA points of that 180,000 FIFA points I've also spent around three to four million coins now 180,000 FIFA points by the way that doesn't come cheap like that's that's money that I'm spending you know it's it, it costs it does cost um, of all that money and coins, I've got a few decent players here or there, you know, a few Danny Alves, some a Yaya Torre, some Vincent Company. Um, I've got a Di Natale, you know, just like players that are, are worth 10, 20, 30, f the odd 50k player here. I've got no one worth anything. I've not got a single legend and I've only got five informs during those 180,000 FIFA points and 5 million coins and all of the informs that I've got have been the lowest rated of the week. So this week I actually got an inform guy. I just spent 36,000 FIFA points before making this video. Not like I actually made, I recorded this video two days ago. I'm recording the, the vid video for this video today, but the, the actual gameplay is from two days ago. So on this very day that the face is getting recorded, I opened 36,000 FIFA points and I got a, one inform worth 10,000 coins. 36,000 FIFA points. That is so many packs, and to get just one in form is outrageous. Uh, I, I just genuinely believe the card weight of every player has dropped massively because I am getting so many terrible, terrible packs to the point where it's genuinely not even worth going near packs. However, I will do because I like this series and man, if we actually get a fucking legend, that will be insane. But let me know about your thoughts on pack openings and how they've, or opening actual packs, not pack opening videos, but opening packs and how the uh, the kind of the fortunes have changed over the last few weeks. Like I notice it massively. I used to be able to get an inform within four to sort sorry five to ten thousand FIFA points. I'd get at least one inform, sometimes two or three. But to open one hundred and eighty thousand FIFA points worth of packs and five million coins, and to get just five throwaway informs outrageous anyway guys this is the end of the video and another poor pack opening the best play i think we got was alaba there storage also sells for a bit but if you could leave a like on the video that'd be awesome thank you guys as always very much for watching and i will see you next time peace